Okay, phase two. Right, phase two, what you do, chop up a few bits of, now you could use Stilton if you wanted to, but I prefer to use something like Gorgonzola or Dolce Latte, it's creamier. So what it does is it gives those sprouts a nice, creamy, cheesy finish. And you get the sharpness of the cranberry through them, I'd imagine. You get the bacon as well. You just crumble all that in there. Lovely. Should we chuck a bit of steel in as well, Dad, just to be excessive? What do you reckon? We need to. <coughs> we might not need to, but I'm going to get my bit of steel and off. Bosh. Bosh. Bang, 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 bang. Get it in there. We've got a Bosch washing machine. Have you? I'm not going to promote brand stuff. No. <laughs> That's alright. Maybe a bit of steel in as well. Right, the Christmas sprouts are looking lovely. Get the duck breast out of the oven. Because we can do that about 10 minutes. Yeah, lovely. Right, mix all that around. Oh, mama. Oh, mama. And there you have Jimmer's Christmas sprouts with gorgonzola, bacon, and cranberry. We'll have them with a nice bit of duck and some dofoise potatoes. Sorted. Any requests for anything between now and Christmas, please let me know because I have my pops as a cameraman and we'll do them for you. Thank you very much. And you can stop it. <laughs>